I am Anil Kumar and we will explore the property of symmetry for Pascal's triangle in this particular video. Now as you know, uh, we can just make a Pascal's triangle and then we will explore the symmetry. So we can start with n equals to 0. So in that case it is just 1 and when n is equals to 1 then we get 1 and 1. This is the Pascal's triangle. For n equals to 2, uh, we have three values here for coefficients 1, 2, and 1. And for n equals to 3, uh, we get four coefficients, correct? Uh, and these coefficients are 1, 3, 3, 1. You add the previous two to get the next, right? So for 4, uh, we'll have five coefficients. Now, these coefficients are 1, 4, 6, 3 plus 3, 3 plus 1, and 1 for n equals to 5. We can kind of continue this, right? So we'll have 6 coefficients here for n equals to 5. And these are 5, 10, 10, 5, and 1. What you really notice in this particular case is that there is a symmetry correct so so the symmetry is that t n r is actually equals to t n n minus r right so what we notice here is that in any row of pascal's triangles entry equidistant from each end are equal right so so what we notice here is that entries from each end are equal right so so that is what we notice and this is called the property of, of symmetry we are just numbering these properties one two three four we'll number this as property one for pascal's triangle now we have also linked pascal's triangle with binomial coefficients so from here we can say that ncr is equals to nc n minus r right so this property should hold good for the binomial coefficients also since all these entries in the pascal's triangle are actually coefficients for binomials correct now here is a very simple proof for for the same right so let me just give you the proof here so what is ncr in general in general we have uh, let me write down what ncr in general is it is n factorial divided by r factorial times n minus r factorial so what is n times c n minus r equals to so we'll use the same formula numerator will be n factorial denominator we have got this term instead of r so it is n minus r factorial and now what we have is n minus r that means n minus n minus r so we have n minus n minus r becomes plus r is that okay that factorial and then we can simplify this we get n minus r factorial n minus n is zero so we get r factorial here which is same as ncr so this is kind of the proof for the symmetry of Pascal's triangle. I hope this point is very clear that the Pascal's triangle have a symmetry and the binomial coefficients ncr is equals to nc n minus r, correct? So based on this, we can have sometimes few questions. Let us say if I have uh, binomial coefficients could be written in very different ways. So if I have binomial coefficients, let's say uh, 10c4, then it should be equal to what right so you could just figure it out so of course we are saying n and n is same 10 uh, n minus r 10 minus 4 is 6 so this is how they're kind of related right so uh, based on this we'll solve some questions and i hope the concept of symmetry is very clear linking pascal's triangle with the binomial coefficients i'm anil kumar and i hope that helps thank you and all the best.